Welcome to 360 Boosts channel. Are you struggling with weight loss? This is a common question that sparks a journey full of discovery, transformation, and self-improvement. In today's video, we're focusing on sustainable weight loss and wellness. We're exploring various elements of this journey, such as mindful eating, physical activity, and the crucial role hydration plays. We're going to delve into the importance of long-term lifestyle changes and explain why quick fixes aren't the solution. We'll also discuss the roles of sleep and stress management in impacting your weight and overall health. We'll have our about seeking support and guidance, understanding the role mindset plays in weight loss, and how to keep track of your progress while setting achievable goals. Remember, this journey isn't just about shedding pounds, it's about transforming your life to prioritize health, wellness, and self-care. But before we dive in, we'd love to hear your experiences. Have you tried any weight loss strategies before? Share with us in the comments below, and don't forget to subscribe to our For More Wellness Tips. Now let's dive into the first step towards sustainable weight loss, adopting a mindful and balanced approach to eating. So, what does mindful and balanced eating look like? Well, it's all about embracing foods that are nutrient-dense. We're talking fruits, vegetables, whole grains, lean proteins, and healthy fats. These power-packed choices not only furnish your body with essential nutrients, but they also promote a feeling of fullness, helping to keep your overall calorie intake in check. But here's the kicker. It's not just about what you eat, it's also about how much you eat. Portion control is key, especially with foods that are high in calorie density. It's easy to overeat when you're dealing with delicious foods, but a little mindfulness can go a long way. Then comes the avoidance game. Processed foods and those rich in added sugars and unhealthy fats might be tempting, but they're not your friends in this journey. They're often low in nutrients and high in calories, a combination that's likely to derail your weight loss efforts. So here's a handy tip. The next time you're about to reach for that bag of chips or soda, pause for a moment. Ask yourself, is this food nourishing my body or just my cravings? Making these mindful choices might seem challenging at first, but remember, it's a journey. And with each mindful choice, you're taking a step towards a healthier, happier you. Remember, it's all about balance and moderation, not deprivation. It's about making choices that fuel your body and satisfy your soul, without feeling like you're missing out. Because, at the end of the day, that's what sustainable weight loss is all about. Now let's talk about the role of physical activity in weight loss. Incorporating regular physical activity into our daily routine is essential for sustainable weight management. When we exercise, we burn calories and build muscle, which in turn boosts our metabolism. But the key to sticking to an exercise regimen is finding activities that you genuinely enjoy. Walking, for instance, is a simple and accessible activity that can be done anywhere, anytime. Cycling, on the other hand, is a fun way to explore your surroundings while breaking a sweat. If you prefer a more calming and centered approach, yoga might be your cup of tea. Or perhaps you're someone who thrives in a more structured environment, in which case a gym workout or a fitness class could be a great fit. The options are endless, and the choice is yours. Remember, the goal is not to exhaust yourself, but to stay active and feel good. Find an activity you love, and it won't feel like a chore. Hydration and mindfulness are key to successful weight loss. The importance of staying hydrated can never be overstated. Drinking plenty of water throughout the day is essential as it aids in controlling your appetite and boosting your metabolism. Think of it as your body's natural fuel, keeping your system running smoothly while you navigate your journey to wellness. Now let's talk about mindful eating. It's not just about what you eat, but how you eat. Take time to appreciate the food you're consuming. Pay attention to its taste, texture, and aroma. This practice can enhance your enjoyment of meals and snacks, helping you feel satisfied with less. Listen to your body's signals. Hunger and fullness cues are your body's way of communicating its needs. When you feel full, stop eating. If you're still hungry, it's okay to eat a little more. The key is to maintain a balance. Remember, your body knows what it needs. You just need to listen to it. Scene script. Quick fixes? They don't work. Let's focus on long-term changes instead. You see, short-term diets are like band-aids. They might temporarily cover the problem, but they don't address the root cause. They don't teach us how to eat healthily to understand our bodies or to make sustainable lifestyle changes. In fact, they often lead to yo-yo dieting, a cycle of losing and regaining weight which can be harmful to our health. Instead, let's consider weight loss as a journey, a marathon, not a sprint. 
It's about developing new habits that you can maintain in the long run. This isn't just about the food we eat or the exercises we do. It's also about our mindset, our relationship with food and our bodies. Consistency and patience are key here. It's not about being perfect all the time. It's about making better choices more often. It's about progressing, not obsessing. It's about enjoying the journey, not just the destination. Imagine a life where food is not an enemy, but a friend, where exercise is not a punishment, but a celebration of what our bodies can do. That's the kind of life we're aiming for. And remember, this is not a race against others. This is your journey, your body, your pace. You decide what works best for you. Change doesn't happen overnight, but it will happen with consistent effort. Sleep and stress, two factors often overlooked in weight loss. When we skimp on sleep, our bodies produce more hunger hormones and less of those that tell us we're full. This could lead to an increased appetite and unintentional weight gain. Plus, high stress levels can trigger emotional eating, disrupting our weight management efforts. Now here's a few tips to better manage sleep and stress. First, establish a regular sleep schedule. Hit the hay and wake up at consistent times to help regulate your body's internal clock. Second, create a restful environment. This might mean investing in blackout curtains or perhaps using earplugs. As for stress, regular physical activity is a fantastic stress buster. You might also consider mindfulness techniques like meditation or deep breathing exercises. Remember, it's okay to take time for yourself to relax and unwind. Your mind needs rest and peace just as much as your body. Weight loss is not just a physical journey, but a mental one as well. It's no secret that shedding weight can be challenging, and it's crucial to remember that it's perfectly okay to seek support. Professional advice from dietitians or nutritionists can provide personalized dietary plans tailored to your needs and lifestyle. These experts are equipped with the knowledge to guide you towards healthier food choices and portion sizes. Additionally, engaging with support groups or communities can offer motivation and accountability. Hearing others' stories, sharing your own, and knowing that you're not alone can be incredibly empowering. It can keep you on track and provide an environment of understanding, which is essential in this journey. Now let's delve into the mental aspects of weight loss. Guilt or shame associated with food choices can often create negative cycles, but it's important to break these patterns. Your brain plays a significant role in cravings and food choices. By understanding this, you can better manage these cravings and make more mindful decisions. Remember, weight loss isn't about punishing yourself. It's about establishing a healthier relationship with food and your body. It's about nourishing yourself, not depriving. It's about progress, not perfection. And while it may be a challenging journey, it's also a rewarding one. It's a journey filled with learning, growth, and self-discovery. It's a journey towards a healthier, happier you. And in this journey, always remember you're not alone. Let's talk about goals and progress. When it comes to weight loss, it's vital to set achievable goals. We're not talking about shedding an excessive amount of weight in an unrealistic time frame. No, we're focusing on sustainable, healthy weight loss. This might mean losing one to two pounds a week, or it could be as simple as aiming to eat five servings of fruits and vegetables each day. Monitoring progress is equally crucial. It's not just about stepping onto the scale, but also about noting how you feel, how your clothes fit, and the positive changes you're making in your eating and exercise habits. Remember, the scale doesn't always reflect your hard work immediately, so don't get disheartened if the numbers aren't dropping as quickly as you'd like. Patience is key in this journey. Weight loss is a gradual process, and it's important to give your body the time it needs to adjust. It's not a race, but a lifelong commitment to healthier living. If you're not seeing immediate results, don't be too hard on yourself. Instead, keep your focus on the long-term benefits of your lifestyle changes. And remember, every small victory counts. Every healthy choice is a win. It's not just about the end result, but the journey itself. Take pride in the steps you're taking to improve your health and well-being. Celebrate every small victory. Each step forward is a step towards wellness. Join us as we delve further into the thrilling world. What's your prediction for the next groundbreaking development? Share your insights below. Remember to hit that subscribe button on 360 Boost's channel to take part in our polls. Make sure to like and subscribe to stay part of our ongoing discussion. What's your perspective on the future of the world and human beings? Let's dissect this together.